Welcome into the video. So today we're back here with the LG C2 and I've been receiving quite a few comments talking about the latest LG software update 03.33.15 and seems to be maybe a bug or something going on with uh, ARC or eARC. And I have to say that I actually encountered this issue myself yesterday, but what I thought I would do this morning is do a air quotes live simulation of how this plays out on my TV. So just to kind of give a little bit of the layout here, this uh, 77 LG C2, uh, everything's connected directly to the TV. Nothing's running directly through the AVR and then the TV. For the AVR, I have a Sony STR-DH790 with an Apple TV 4K third gen, PS5 and Xbox Series X also connected to the C2. So what we want to do is I want to go ahead and turn on the TV for the first time and the normal process here would be turn on the TV, it would automatically kick on the receiver and then I have things set up to where it doesn't automatically switch uh, to the input that's on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press the power button on the TV remote which in theory should kick on the receiver. That's the way it always has worked. And at that point, it would be up to me to turn on a specific input, uh, you know, to proceed with whatever I'm gonna do. So in this case, I'm gonna turn on the Apple TV 4K uh, as the, the next input that we're gonna try out. So let's get started. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the power button on the remote. TV is turning on. Okay, I just heard the receiver kick on. It'll probably say something at the bottom. There it is. It kicked on the receiver. It's The badge is live. Next step here, it looks like it's turning on the Apple TV 4K. It did. So here's the next test to find out. I'm gonna press and hold that settings button and check the audio settings to see if it actually kicked on or is it using the TV speaker. So let's go over here to sound and sound out. It is using ARC. Now I can tell you that one time yesterday uh, it did kick on and the actually what was weird is the receiver kicked on like normal and the Apple TV 4K or whatever input I was using kicked on when I turned it on but the sound out was actually the TV speakers when I started playing content and that was the first time I had encountered that with this TV so I definitely think there is something a, a little bit buggy with this update involving ARC or eARC so I appreciate you those of you that watched my video and made the comments that quickly uh, again I've encountered that myself you saw right here as I was demonstrating on the video that my particular setup this particular time kicked on correctly the way it normally does but that's not to say that the next time I power down the TV and then turn it back on, it won't do that. So LG, love the, uh, the rapid updates. I love that you're always trying to perfect things as far as the image quality, et cetera, TV performance um, consistently. But, you know, last couple of updates, seems like you've injected a couple of bugs there, uh, which you'll typically, looks like you typically will turn right around and shoot out another update that, that helps with it. But you know, I, I just don't want this to turn into a Samsung situation because one of my favorite things about the LG here is the consistent updates that typically don't break things. And last couple of updates, it looks like that's starting to go the other way. Let's hope that that's just an anomaly and, uh, you know, we continue with consistent updates and LG can, you know, be trustworthy with this. So anyhow, that's all I had in this video. Just want to do a quick demonstration of ARC slash eARC on my TV and my setup. Uh, like I said, seems to be working correctly for now. We'll see. Uh, if you did enjoy the video, hit the like button. Doesn't cost you anything. Helps me out a ton. Uh, now's a great time. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. You know, of course, if you're going to subscribe, might as well hit the bell notification, right? So you know when I do an upload. But uh, until the next one.